Is your Windows 11 taskbar not working? In this video, you will see how to fix Windows 11 taskbar not working. You will also see the fixes for Windows 11 taskbar not showing. Restart Windows 11 Most Windows problems can be fixed with a restart. Sometimes Windows services don't properly start causing the taskbar not working, so you should try restarting Windows 11. Since you cannot access the Start menu on the taskbar, you can press Alt plus F4 key and select the Restart option from the drop-down menu, then click OK. Once Windows 11 starts, check the taskbar. If it's still not working, follow the next fixes. Restart Windows Explorer Taskbar and related icons are a part of the Windows Explorer service. It could stop working due to some glitch, so you can try restarting the Windows Explorer service from the Task Manager. Press Control plus Shift plus Escape key together to open the Task Manager. Then locate the Windows Explorer process. You can press the W key to find it quickly. Select it, then click on the Restart button. Wait for a few seconds and check the taskbar. Close some services. Some Windows services could conflict with the taskbar, so you can try closing them. Open the Task Manager. Go to the Details tab. Then locate RuntimeBroker.exe, select it, and click End Task. Then do the same for searchhost.exe, searchindexer.exe, and shellexperiencehost.exe. Now check your taskbar. Repair system files. Windows 11 taskbar not working could be due to some corruption in the system file, so you should try repairing the system files. To run the system repairing commands, you need to open the command prompt with administrator privilege. Open the task manager. Click on File, then select Run New Task. Type CMD in the text box and tick the box of Create this task with administrator privileges. Now click OK. Click Yes if prompted. Now copy the command from the description one by one, paste them, and hit Enter. Wait until one process is finished. It will take some time. Reinstall and re-register all Windows apps. Sometimes Windows inbuilt apps conflict and the taskbar stops working. You can run a single command on PowerShell to reinstall and re-register all Windows apps. This could solve the taskbar not showing in Windows 11. Open the Task Manager. Click on File and select Run New Task. Now type PowerShell in the text box. Select the box of Create this task with administrator privileges. Click OK. Click Yes if prompted. Now copy the command from the description, paste it here, and hit Enter. Modify Registry To fix the taskbar, you should create an XAML key in the registry. Before making any changes to the registry, you should always take a backup of the registry or create a system restore point. To do that, open the Task Manager, click on File and select Run New Task. Now type REG Edit. Click OK. Click Yes if prompted. To back up the registry, click on the File menu. Select Export. Select all from the Export range. Name the backup file and click on Save. In case of any mishappenings, you can import the registry backup. Now copy the registry key location from the description. Paste it on the address bar of the registry editor and hit Enter. Now right-click here. Select New D Word 32-bit value. Rename the key as Enable, XAML, Start Menu. Open it. Enter the zero in the Value Data field and click OK.
Perform System Restore. You can restore your system to a previous date when everything on your machine was working fine. To do that, open Task Manager, click on File, and select Run New Task. Type RST, RUI, and hit Enter. Now you will see the System Restore dialog. Click Next. Now you will see the available restore points. You can click on the Show More Restore Points to see all available points. Then select a restore point. You need to check the date and time of the restore point and select the date on which everything on your PC was working fine. Then click Next. Follow the instructions to restore your PC. Create New User Account If the problem doesn't solve even after restoring the PC, you can create a new user account and work from that account. To create the user account, press Windows plus I button to open Settings. Now click on the Accounts tab. Select Family and Other Users. Under the Other Users, click on Add Account. You can create the user account with your Microsoft account. Enter it, then click Next. If you don't want to use your Microsoft account, click on I don't have this person's sign-in information. Now here you can create a Microsoft account or, in your case, click on Add a user without a Microsoft account. Then enter the details and complete the steps. Then restart your PC and sign in with your new user account. Downgrade to Windows 10 If none of the fixes are working for you, the only option left is to downgrade to Windows 10. You can also try updating Windows 11 and see if a new update fixes your issue. To check the update, press the Windows plus I button to open the settings. Click on Windows Update. Then press Check for Update and install all available updates. If the taskbar is still not working, you should downgrade to Windows 10. We have a video on how to downgrade Windows 11 to Windows 10 with step-by-step -step instructions. You can check the video from the description or click the I button. And that's it for this video. If you have any questions or suggestions, drop them below and share this useful video with your friends. Like the video and subscribe to the channel. Your likes and comments motivate us to create these videos. Don't forget to press the bell button to receive alerts for videos on Windows tips and tricks.